Did you know the same man who saved billions from starvation also created weapons that killed over one million people? Fritz Haber won the 1918 Nobel Prize for inventing synthetic fertilizer that feeds nearly half the world today. But he also developed the first chemical weapons used in warfare. In 1915, he personally supervised the first chlorine gas attack at Ypres, watching as 5,000 soldiers died in agony. His Haber process revolutionized agriculture, preventing mass famine across the globe. Yet at the same time, his poison gas research created mustard gas, phosgene, and other deadly chemicals. The duality was calculated and deliberate. His fertilizer feeds 40% of Earth's population today. His chemical weapons research laid the foundation for Zyklon B, later used in Holocaust death camps. Even his wife Clara, also a chemist, shot herself in protest of his weapons work. But Haber never stopped. He continued developing deadlier chemical agents until his death. One brilliant mind, two devastating legacies. The man who fed the world also poisoned it.